All right, welcome to Beyond Motion down here in Naples, Florida, the mecca of pickleball. All right, what we're doing today is we're with one of our clients, Eric. He's one of our best pickleball players we have. And we've created a warm up for him that makes him injury free. So we're seeing a lot, a lot of injuries. And what we want to do is call something called prehab to get the body ready to play. And you can do this on the court or off the court, it takes five minutes. So we took our shoes off just to show you the emphasis in the demonstration. We also put a cone in front of us. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna stand right next to the cone, hands out in front, and we're gonna test our rotation. And that's gonna be how we test to see which joint opens up the most. We're gonna go to the right. See I lock up right there by the Winston Justice jersey, right bolt four. Now we're gonna go to the left. And I start to lock up almost even with the clock that we have over there. Okay, so. The sport's played from the ankle on up. What's the one joint that we don't emphasize when we warm up? The ankle. So we're going to start there. So what I want to see is you're going to drive your big toe through the ground. And I'm going to give you two views. The first view is going to be the front view, all right? And then I'm going to give you a side view. So this side view, you can see I'm driving the big toe through the ground and get a nice stretch to the arch of my foot. I'm then going to bring the foot to the inside, or I should say the heel. And I'm going to get a nice stretch to the Achilles tendon and also the heel of my foot. And now to the outside. Okay, so once we've done the right, we're going to do the left. We're going to drive the big toe through. And once again, this should feel pretty good. There's no tension on the body. You're getting a stretch throughout the ankle. You're mobilizing the joint. Bring the heel to the inside. in the outside. So now we're going to have our athlete retest. So now he's going to put both feet right next to the cone. Retest starting coming to my right. How much farther would you say? How much farther can I go? No farther. Were you from the beginning? I actually am a little bit farther. Probably about a foot farther. A foot farther? Okay. Other side? Okay, so we've got 12 inches difference right there. And that should just open up one joint, and that's the ankle joint. Okay? The next thing we're going to do is we're going to put our hands on our hips. All right? And we're going to do a hip circle. 10 to the right, 10 to the left. So we've done this in PE decades ago. All right? We didn't know why we are doing it, though. So now we know why. We're starting to get the joints to open up. So all of a sudden, when we do movement that's dynamic, we don't compensate and hurt ourselves. So if we go to the right, then we go to the left. And then after that, we're going to go into flexion and extension. And I like to see about 10 each, flexion, extension. But for time reference, we'll just do two. And we'll have Eric retest here. So hands to center, retest to my right. Farther? A little bit farther. OK, retest to my left. Okay, so those are three positive tests that we have on him. So before he gets out on the court, I want him to mobilize his ankles, his hips, and his back by the flexion and extension. Okay? The next thing we're going to do, and the last thing we're going to do, is a neck one. So what I want to do is I want to have my hand on my chin. All right? And so I'm going to push my chin in and push it out. In and out. In and out. Nice. See, you feel the stretch through the neck there? Mm -hmm. Perfect. And now I'm going to go to the side, shoulder to ear. Or I should say ear to shoulder. Ear to shoulder. And then chin to chest. And chin up. All right, Eric, let's retest. Once again, we do 10 reps of everything, condensed version, just so we don't spend 30 minutes showing you this. Mm, a little bit better. Yeah, quite a bit better. Quite a bit. 
Okay, so how do you feel right now? Good. Feel good? Loose. Feel loose? So that was warm up, and did we move at all? Not necessarily. We didn't do skips, all right, which we like to do with our dent for our uh, dynamic warm up here. And we didn't do any kind of pattern that's elastic stretching or I should say static stretching. This is stuff just to make sure that the joint's open so when he steps a foot forward, everything coordinates in junction to do that movement and that step forward. All right, therefore all the muscle, muscles, tendons, and ligaments function in the proper movement patterns. Okay, so you feel good? Feel you feel good. ready to play? Yeah. You can do this on the court? Yes. Love it. Okay, so. We're at Beyond Motion down here in Naples, Florida. Once again, he uses our virtual training website, which is beyondmotiontraining.com. All right, you can sign up, you can tell us what you have, what you have in the basement, what you have in the living room. We can correlate and coordinate a program around that and make it personalized just for you. Or you come down here and get your own personalized program, and that's at Beyond Motion. I'll give you our other website, and that's go, the number two, beyondmotion.com. Pickleball is getting huge. It's time to prepare the bodies to play the game instead of just going out there and playing. Thank you.